So you're ready for a back pose? Let's have some fun. I love these. Obviously the weight's off for this leg right here. And this hip is high. You can tell by pretty much a straight line would be here. And we'll bring the shoulders down a little bit. Let's see if we can push it a little bit. Now with the charcoal, I'm just gonna keep doing different uh, techniques, okay? Let's go head. See right there. Neck. We're gonna come around this way. Rib cage. Let's pull in like that. Pelvis. Straight line down. Arm. Arm. So we're using a scribble technique, but it also has shape and it has anatomy in it too. My lay-ins actually have anatomy. See? So, you know, rectus spiny muscles and, you know, back, the bottom of the, uh, the box for the pelvis, but you try this first and then we'll come right back, okay? Uh, you go ahead, I'm gonna go jog for about 10 miles and I'll be right back, give you a little time, okay? I'll be right back, go. So, how'd you do? Did you remember to push it? See here, I could have pushed this pose a lot more. But maybe I wanted it subtle, I don't know. But let's see, let's bring this area here out and we'll bring this down a little bit there. That's enough, that works. Now watch, what we can do is work straight down. Can you guys see that? Yeah, probably good enough. Here we go. Everything at one time. See, when you do G-cat all at the same time, that's called drawing. So we wanna get as much of this into muscle memory as possible. Thinking about proportions. So I'm going to make it a little bit longer. Latissimus dorsi. Rhomboid. Where's your, your scapula? Coming around this way, pushing up. Okay. How does this fit in? See, even if it's up there a little bit, a little fat. Right here, the sacrum. Boom. The posterior iliac crest, gluteus medius, gluteus maximus. Right here, straight line. Curve coming down. Pull. Pull around from the back of the scapula, the rhomboid, serratus anterior, sternal oblique. So you got that nice push. Box shape. Cast shadow, core shadow. Core, core. Into the shadow there. See how that's working? Okay, this leg is going away from us, so this goes inside. This is all quick sketch. So you notice there's really no such thing as a gesture drawing. What's a gesture drawing? It's like, I don't know, it's like baking a cake, just calling it butter. Okay, here you go, here's a cake. You ready? Looks like butter. Yeah, yeah, it's butter. No, I want a cake. No, 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 it's, it's okay, the butter is in the cake. No, it's not a cake. It's just a cube of butter. Yeah, I know, but there's butter in the cake. So there you go. What's the problem? It doesn't taste good. So why do we want to do a just drawing that's just gesture? We want anatomy. Can't, you know, gesture is the story. But you want to get your hands around the anatomy, right? In drawing, of course. Round. So it all comes together. Come together right now. Draw for me. Do 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 do. Okay, are you excited? 
Are you ready to give it a shot? The answers are all in the other videos. I'm not trying to pimp them, all right? Just trying to let you know that they're there. Okay, because this is the Demo Draw Along series. I should do an infomercial. But wait, if you buy now, you get the new Demo Draw Along series. Go get them, guys. I'll see you in a sec.